Hello everyone, in this video, uh, since I'm an Ubuntu user and also Azure lover, I wanted to install the Storage Explorer in my Ubuntu machine. And uh, this very easy way to install if you have the Snap enabled for your machine. So we'll just copy this one and we'll go to uh, Ubuntu Fresh uh, command line. We'll paste on paste the command over here open a new one there we go and uh, provide the password uh, so once I have the password provided um, it's, it's really cool the way it downloads uh, it's just going to download the storage explorer from a stable channel and we'll have this available in a minute and then we can use the storage explorer to connect to all the storage that we have available in our uh, Azure instances so I'll just uh, give it a second to download it's already 44 percent so it's going pretty fast so it should be by like 20 more seconds and we'll be done so pause the video for a few seconds and be back another thing uh, if you're wondering what is a snap uh, snap is automatically enabled for most of the recent ubuntu machines. like mine is 19.04 uh, ubuntu <coughs> and if you look at it snap is already installed and ready to go so if you have 18 or 16 or later pretty much you have the snap installed that's a that's a new way to manage your packages so let's see that it's everything is done and it says the tool is not available there is a tick mark so let's go over here let's see as your storage is really showing right there so now we can click on it <coughs> and the storage explorer should show up and there we go so Microsoft Explorer must be connected to the system's password manager service to keep your data safe but service plug has not been connected yet please run the following commands before launching the application again so this we need to do so click OK and uh, go back and perform some additional configuration that you need to do and start using Microsoft storage Explorer on a Ubuntu machine. Thank you very much. As a matter of fact, let's run the command while we are here. So let's come over here. So that's the command snap connect storage explorer password manager service password manager service. So hit enter. So provide your password again. And there we go so this command it's run successfully so we'll just go back to here and we'll click on the azure storage manager one more time see what's going on with this and looks like progress has been made after we ran that command and there we go we have the microsoft storage explorer over here end user agreement you can read it uh, who reads that i don't know so uh, but you should uh, you click on i accept and here you can uh, connect to azure you can use different uh, options that you can use to connect to your environment uh, as your environment what is your azure environment you can use the add a resource directory you can use that uh, you can just directly use a Azure account and uh, or you can use a, a storage account name and a key you can use that to attach to a local emulator you can use the connection string so lots of options available to you so hope you like the video and be able to connect to Azure and start using it thank you actually really let's try to log in actually so since we are here uh, let's hit next if I do next it's just going to ask you for the Azure account that you want to use so let's 
So I'm just going to use the account that I'm currently using and provide the password. And see if uh, the Story Explorer can connect to my Azure instance, Azure subscription, and show me stuff. Well, look at that. So it's uh, logging in just fine. All so it's connected. I have this subscription, and everything looks like is available to me. And there are other things in here that you can take a look at and here I'll just say apply so once I say apply so you can see how many different storage accounts I have in my environment I have looks like a whole bunch and I bet three of them are associated with three of the virtual machines that I created and one of them is most likely created when I first said hey I want to use the uh, Azure CLI from the from the web so you can now go in there you can look at what we have there and all that kind of stuff okay so hopefully I, I'm just gonna stop here so in this video we went over uh, a bunch of different things first of all how you install the storage explorer in Ubuntu using the snap command I'm gonna give the command in my in my video description and then how to configure this to connect to your Azure instance uh, we'll go over this Azure storage and the disk and everything else in, in much greater details in future videos. This is just a quick introduction to get you get started with using this product, uh, especially if you're in a Ubuntu machine. Thank you.